structured to a structured approach. I, I agree. The only thing which, I mean, with the NICE guidelines, one is that even though they are UK guidelines, I think they're used internationally. Lots of countries go back and look at the NICE guidelines. And the other thing is that they, I mean, at least for the pediatric epilepsy, they do, and, and also for the others, they have asked people who were very active in the ILA. So Helen Cross um, was in the anti-seizure guys guidelines and John Duncan. So it, it, there is an overlap, which is reassuring. But yeah, I agree, it's, it's, it's difficult. And I fully agree with the low income countries that, or in the lower resource countries that there needs to be adaptation in every way. In each, yeah, also for neonatal seizures, definitely. Perfect. I think we have one minute and 27 uh, seconds left. We got the little bell. <laughs> and uh, I'm sure we could continue to, to talk for quite some time about, about guidelines and, and standards and Delphi and patient involvement and care partner involvement in guidelines. So. But um, there's still much work to be done. I want to thank all of you for, for participating. All of our panelists, thank you so much for your excellent presentation. And for those of you who have put in so much effort, you know, Marco and Ronit and Hans and, and the, into these, these uh, amazing, you know, kind of a recommendation document you're developing. And, and thank you for all of you and, and Francisco for, for co-chairing this session as well. So, Enjoy the rest of the IEC meeting. There are 40 seconds left. If anyone has anything exciting to, <laughs> to say, uh, now is your chance. And I, I see somebody put up something about epilepsy safety. <laughs> so. All right, well, enjoy the rest of your- Thank uh, you very much. It has been really a great pleasure. <laughs> Thank see you, you soon. Thank you, Natalie. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye. Thank you so much, everyone.